Howdy folks, this is Lanso90 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Cataclysm Dark Days Ahead. Alright, let's hop in the car. I guess try to get to this electronic store, maybe it won't be battened down. I don't know what I need to get past it. I don't know what I need to get past the metal bars and windows, maybe the hacksaw? Never tried it. I do have the hacksaw with me, don't I? Well, the iBot's there now, so probably not worth it. Ooh. Once we have some more guns, then we can probably mess around with stuff like that. But right now, the slathering, slathering yotes. Fortunately, I do need to go towards them. What the heck? I must have had my hand in the wrong spot. I was trying to turn instead. No, no, no. I don't want to hit you guys. A little bit of a tight gap here. Screw. Should be able to go through the tall grass. Big old military truck there, though. What is that? The, someone was telling me the Humvee is, like, particularly good. Like, even better than, like, having a, uh, an RV. Not exactly sure why, though. I guess if you're gonna run over zombies inside of town, it might be pretty good. Treatment that'll probably radiate us. Oh god, a moose. Anything but a moose. What the hell? Okay, well, this one, yeah. Oh, it's a small child. Kind of sad. Smush. Yeah, I guess bodies do are infected now. I guess that's what people have meant by they do just get up now, but it's like, man. Well, it used to be they were their names weren't in yellow, and they didn't have the death icon. Above them. Massive's fighting zombies. We do have animal discord, so the mastiffs might get angry at us. Oh god, that's a lot of zombies. Oh, that's wolves. Doggos. Yeah, the wolves are fighting the moose. It's not gonna go so well. Oh, they actually did it. The son of a goats did it. I mean, it makes sense, like, logically in real life, that's what happened to a moose getting attacked by a pack of wolves. It's just, uh, normally the moose in this game is, like, a thousand times stronger than even real moose are. And real moose are no joke, of course, but... I don't know if we have a refillable lighter yet, so I might as well grab it. I don't want to get this dog angry. I think they've generally made dogs less aggro than they used to be, but... I do have the animal discord on, so that might change things. Alright, computer store. Alright, this one's much more... Friendly to receiving outsiders. Food dehydrator, I'll take it. Lamp, flashlight, not necessary. Ram sticks, not necessary. What version of Ram is it? Just says a stick of memory, it's unrealistic. I should say which one. A file, you put documents in it. 
Charge the battery. Three player. Smartphone. E ink tablet PCs. Lots of crates that I gotta pop open. That dog got angry. And cool things about being a ring bearer. Book this delightful little ring bearer in your wedding. <laughs> I was like, is this about uh, Lord of the Rings? Oh, is this just like a mom and pop electronics store? Because there's a house up top of it. Sort of seen that way. I don't know what I'm expecting to see new in these buildings, but we'll take the eggs because the like, scrambled eggs are always pretty good. Oil is always pretty good. Could feed the dog. Although the one that's already angry probably is a, a lost cause, I would think. Actually, a lot of good stuff here. Coating, that's the good stuff. I'm gonna grab any more multivitamins or anything. I will grab the cotton balls though, since they seem to be pretty useful. It's a duplex up top. Dang, that's a lot of stuff here, man. If you're not gonna make up your mind if you're attacking me or not, you're gonna get the bonk. Hello, wolfos. Like to give them food and have them be my friend. Do. -do. These. Don't need any of that. The hydrator can go. The wolves are actually living me alone more than the dogs are. <laughs> kind of funny. Would be pretty awesome though if you could tame a wolf in this game. Not gonna lie. Hard cheese, sports drink, yogurt, it's all good stuff. Detergent, still good stuff. Breads are always incredibly useful. I think I need more fruit jam. I think we got a lot of fruit jam. Battery strings. Oh, duct tape, absolutely. Need duct tape for almost everything in the game. Grab the soap. Don't drop the soap. Okay. Tarnation of that. North. Ain't a north. This is north. Sure, that's not as good as our butchering kit, though. Weird. Oh, I guess that's like a. meant to represent like the fire escape. 
Never smush this zombie here. Actually do want to go click on these dogs and just see if maybe uh Once extinct in the England area, the wolf was successfully reintroduced and her numbers reached record highs the decade before the cataclysm. Lucky you. I am very curious. There's no way, right? You know, 99% of video games, the answer is definitely no, because they don't want you to, you know, they don't want kids to see it and be like, oh, I can go tame a dog, or I can do tame a wolf with dog food. Find the thing. Uh, too much stuff. We're gonna have to use the uh, van sort here. Dog. Now we have to be careful. This... Let's save it actually. Because if this is possible, I want it to work. Step one, obviously, is to kill these zombies for the box. They might have taken too much damage and ran off now, though. wolf. Well. <laughs> so much for trying that, I guess. Oh well. It probably wouldn't have worked. I'm just saying it'd be very cool if it was. Anyway, what I was saying is they don't want kids to see the game and be like, I can go tame a wolf and get their throat torn out. Except wolves actually don't do that, so. They're actually being less realistic by not letting you tame the wolf with dog food. Well, what do we still need? We still need a acetylene torch, right? Which is going to require garages. There is the golf course. I would like to try to get the golf bag. And I do believe it is the best bag. I think it's big enough to fit, like, the planks and stuff in it. Let's not run over the child body. <laughs> Already gruesome enough, I would say. Basically, none of the other golf stuff's worth it other than the bag. But, I do want to compare the bag. Unfortunately, I will have to drop it to compare it properly. Alright, golf bag. So the golf bag is basically like having a bag in the old game. Because it's a rigid body, it just has a default encumbrance, but it doesn't go up for putting stuff in it. And I guess it does a little bit, but not much.
So it's very encumbering to wear it at all. But it's friggin' gigantic. Has a total capacity of 43 liters, whereas our duffel bag has 35, but most of it is in just one pocket, which has a very long item length. A huge weight capacity, and then it also has extra pockets too. I think this is what I want. Gonna have straps to be worn on the back and a slot for an umbrella. That's what I want. The good old days. The good old days. How buy how bags works. <laughs> I think that will also allow us to wear or pick up planks and stuff. Ooh, we can take the halogen. Well, we'll have to drop it every time we go into combat because it's so heavy, but. Oh, baby. The game's screwed now, man. That was the only thing slowing me down. Yeah, out of here, bird. It's not who yeah. There's usually never anything that good up here. It's kind of the price you pay for, uh, doing the spawn spot, even though it's, like, a really great place to spawn. That was some, like, really good alcohol, though. Fortunately, our character can't really drink it. Or at least just a pigeon in the way, really. Get out of here, pigeon. We've got golf carts. The middle one there has a decent amount of battery. Not too much use of them anymore, but at the start of the game, if you get one of those, it's kind of nice. It doesn't have any solar panels, so it just runs out of power eventually. <laughs> What's our trunk here? Alright. Now, Trumbull would be an easy place to clear out. Terry Helipad probably has turrets on it. I'm curious about the light in our street, too. Most is a freaking torch. A hardware store might have it. I think we'll go to the small town because it'll be really easy to clear it out. We can get everything we want out of the small town. See, this tile set is just kind of very. There's just like so much detail. In, like this particular view. It's actually less useful. For high speed driving, at least. Okay. Drop the bag, because it is extremely heavy. For some reason. I plugged in all the stuff for uh, my VR system. For some reason today it just like periodically like boots up or something. My computer's like, hey, you plugged something in. You know, it's been plugged in the whole time. It's very strange how many computer errors I get, despite the fact I have an incredibly high hand. <laughs> and I'm incredibly computer literate you think uh that looks like an rv i think i wouldn't have too many problems let's try to keep things from hitting this rv here even at the sacrifice of our own hp oops that means that could be a meth van because they're kind of the same thing in this game a female zombie over there is God, what the hell? Not sure how we aggroed that many zombies at once. Let's try to find a decent spot here. We should be okay here. Get a bit 
spicy just because there's so many of them. Yeah. Bleeding is dealt with. Gummy vitamins. Should take those, but we need to sit down to do it properly, unfortunately. Let our character pant here for a minute. I apologize. Probably start using my caffeinated chewing gum a little bit more often, too, for situations like that. Alright. We didn't have to fight them like that, but I didn't want them to hit this vehicle. They were all piled up on it. It's just a mobile meth lab. Just... Yeah. It's not nearly as good as having a... Uh, Prescription stimulus. Or V, you know. This stuff, I don't even want it to go into our SWAT armor. I don't know, sh don't know exactly how I would uh, tell it not to, though. Stepped into that telephone pole, I thought we lagged. I was like, huh? Bloated zombie. but I'll let us clear out the town a little quicker anyway. Do some leading stro- Oop, that means up there. Did we bleed? No. Soda kid. Nothing personnel. This looks like some kind of van. It's not big enough to be an RV though. Food truck. Might get might end up with a food truck because it's at least modestly close. It has a workbench too, which is actually pretty good. Food person's cape. <laughs> Weird way of phrasing that, but okay. Canned chickens. I love when like the plural phrasing is messed up in this game. It's just kind of funny to me. There's no reason to take the food out of there if it's staying cool in there. But we're all out of time for this video. Hope you all enjoyed. If you did, remember to hit the like button. Keep the conversation going in the comments and subscribe if you want to see more. YouTube puts a stronger emphasis on viewer engagement now these days, which is all the things I just listed. So it's appreciated more now than ever, but it always has been. And until next time, hope you have a good day.